<laughs> and Bible story. So we hope you're all well. And this is our Bible story for Sunday morning. It includes a sheep down here and a little bit more about animals. Because if you've got an animal, you know that you have to look after it and you have to feed it and you have to clean its poo when it does poo. Like my animal, because my animal's name is Bubba. Bubba, boots, coming out. And Bubba knows my voice. And Bubba, when I say sit, sit. Sit, Bootsy. Sit. Let me say sit. Sit, sit. Sit, sit. Good girl. Right. Not bad, not bad. But Bubba, you know, doesn't always listen to our voice. But because there's shepherds like Grandma. And sheep. We've got a, a Come sheep on, here. Sheepy. And the sheep, yeah. they listen to the shepherd and they do what the shepherd says. Just listen yeah. to the sheep, they can talk too. Well, yeah. a shepherd is really good at looking after the sheep. And there are some people who are shepherds too in the Bible. And the shepherd would guide and lead them to places that they want to eat and drink water. And the sheep are not always very smart, are they? <laughs> no. <laughs> sheep are not always smart, but they learn to follow the shepherd. They follow the shepherd. They know when he's talking to them and they follow along, recognising that he will lead them to good things. And if there's a wolf nearby or a bear tries to attack the sheep, the shepherd looks after them. Yeah, and he hides behind me. And he hides. See, so in our story today, Jesus is compared to being like the shepherd. They said that he's the good shepherd. And he said that he is the way to life. And anyone else that might try to stake a claim or trick us or get you, he will look after us. So Jesus is the good shepherd. We can trust in Jesus to provide for us and to protect us just like the shepherd does. And he said that a good shepherd would even lay down his life for his sheep and that's exactly what Jesus did so we can trust in his promises and we can rejoice that our shepherd has rescued us from our sin and that he is the good shepherd and if we, and if we listen to his voice then he will lead us and guide us in all that we have to do so here's our little prayer grandma and I are going to say our prayer uh, for today's bible story dear God thank you for being the good shepherd help us to listen to your voice and to follow you and trust you. We know that you will guide us and protect us. Thank you for caring about us. Thank you for your love. We love you, God. In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. You would have been a good shepherd. I think you're a better shepherd than a sheep, to be honest. Bye. Excellent look, Bon. And look, the sheep are following you. Bye. Great look.